Hey guys, this is Dan, creator of the Samurai Boy webcomic. I had decided to register some of my process on the making of the comic. And for today's video, I've got a background design 100% made, once again, using Illustrator. For this scene, a chapel in a valley near a river stream, seen from above. As you can see, I've had previously sketched it in a very rough way, very loosely, then I start to define the sketch a little better and to refine the artwork altogether. It is very useful to do that in Illustrator because, as you can see, I kind of get to ink it at the same time as I get to color it. In some parts I use geometric shapes and the pen tool to mask objects, but for the most part I use the broad brush tool to sketch and draw. It is very intuitive, and if you have a good enough computer, the broad brush in Illustrator will work very smoothly, almost like a regular brush does in Photoshop or Clip Studio. And for coloring, I've developed a technique that saves me a lot of time. What I do is, and you can see it when I color the roof, for example, I take the object I just drew and I copy it. Then I grab the direct selection tool and I delete the outside part of the artwork, which leaves an object that corresponds to the insides of the drawing. I then change its color and finally paste back the outline on top of it using command V which results in the finished drawing. All you gotta do next is repeat this process for each item. So, this is a chapel. In the story, there's a moment when Hiko's friends are kidnapped by a villain, there's a fight, and the samurai boy gets beaten by his nemesis and kind of humiliated too. I'll be posting the link for that specific part on the story in the video description. Anyway, this ninja character who beats Hiko tells him that if he ever wants to see his friends again, he should come to the chapel by the river. So this is the referred chapel. It is not in the original comic in this way though. Right after the fight with the purple ninja, the samurai boy goes to practice with his dad, and then he goes on a journey. He enters this cave where he learns the valuable lessons he needs and also gets the key to the chapel. I'll also be posting the link to, to that part of the story in the video description as well. Anyway, once he gets to the, the, the chapel, however, he is seen inside it already which means the reader never gets to see how the chapel looks on the outside. But since I've now started this channel and also a Patreon account, I thought it was a good idea to redraw some parts of the story, including some establishing shots such as this one, to smooth in the storytelling and to give a more dramatic reading to some of the scenes. So some of these new pieces will be available on Webtoons, where I recently started to republish The Samurai Boy, but the full story with the new and exclusive artworks and scenes will be available for Patreon supporters only. Well, this is it for today, guys. I'll be posting more fan art and more process videos like this every week. If that is something that interests you, I might in the future also post some tutorials as well in longer format videos with comments and step by step. We'll be seeing more about that in the future. Thank you very much for watching. Please share and support. Go read our webcomic Samurai Boy entirely for free and don't forget to subscribe. Bye bye.